Hi, this is Jared Dees with Ave Maria Press High School Religious Education. Today I'm going to give you 10 tips for using the Google search engine for teachers and students. So almost everyone has used Google to do a search. Um, let's say I wanted to search for Jesus. Of course, the, all the results on the web that are stored in Google come up. Um, but I want to give 10 kind of specific ways or other ways we can use the Google search engine just by adding a few little marks or, or words to further refine our results. So one of those is using quotation marks. Let's say I wanted to search for Jesus of Nazareth. Uh, I could type it in and you can see there's a little over three and a half million search results. If I add quotation marks on the two ends of the search entry, you can see the number decreases a little bit. So um, these are only web pages that have the words Jesus of and Nazareth in that order um, specifically. So that's the first tip. The second thing is, let's say I'm, I'm making this search, but I'm not really interested in the movie. You can see the movie is very well um, represented in the results. If I just use a minus or hyphen movie, it will get rid of all the results that had um, the Jesus of Nazareth movie. Instead, all I'm left with it are results that just talk about Jesus of Nazareth. So that's using a, a minus or a hyphen in the search entry. Another thing you can do is find synonyms for words. So, for example, the sacrament of reconciliation um, is also known as the sacrament of penance, or sometimes even um, confession. So, because the results for penance and, and reconciliation are probably very similar and, and probably both very quality resources, if I put a tilde sign in the search entry. You can see the results pull up not only Sacrament of Reconciliation, but also Sacrament of Penance. So the word Reconciliation is being substituted at, with the word Penance and probably some other ones that are coming up in some search entry. So that's a, that's a way to use a, a synonym or find a synonym of a word that you might be searching for. Um, the next tip is to use a, an asterisk sign or star um, when you're typing in your search entry. So if you're maybe you're trying to remember a quotation or the, the end of a, a word, you can use the, the asterisk to um, essentially it will, it will find the word for you or it, it will complete the sentence for you. So for example, the, you know, the common, common definition of, of Eucharist is the source and summit of, of our and you don't know the rest. You can say Vatican II and I, I don't remember the quote so I'm going to type in source and summit of, and if I just put an asterisk and click, um, you can see it'll complete the sentence in bold as if I was searching for Christian life or whole Christian life. So these are the examples of the completion of the sentence for you. So this is really helpful if you're trying to remember a, a, a quote that you can't remember the exact wording of it. Um, just typing in those asterisks can really can complete it for you. Another thing is using uh, the ellipses. So it, if you want to just, just know certain results of certain years or time, you can do that. Um, Ignatius of Antioch, and you wanted to know just the, the days of his supposed death during the years or during the, emp the reign of Emperor Trajan. You type in, you know, dot, 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 and just the results are only the years in that you've entered. Um, some other things you can do is define words. If you just write the word define and then put a colon and type the word, let's say a tough word like epiclesis from the catechism, you can see definitions of that word come up. Um, and you may want to investigate the, the validity of what's coming up. Um, going back to reconciliation again, reconciliation, capital O-R. The O-R will, will show results of web pages that have both reconciliation or penance. Um, some other tips you can use are site. You can search a certain site for keywords like video and then all the websites, all the pages on yavramirpress.com website will have that have the word video will come up. Or you can look for sites that are related to other sites like Vatican or usccb.org and here's all the websites that are related. And finally, control F is a nice little function. If you see it comes up in the bottom here, I can find the word that I'm searching for in case I'm not, I don't have time to skim through. It'll pull up the exact word I'm looking for.